Uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you're doing well and um, without further ado, let's go into today's video. Today we're gonna talk about Makeup Geek. I purchased some um, items from them recently. They were just delivered yesterday and I am so excited to try them on. They're like gorgeous gorgeous colors that we have to try on and um, I'm really excited so let's go let's get on the road with this one um what we're gonna try we're gonna do we're gonna try this flawlessly flawlessly ever after uh, ebony empress face palette and we're just gonna do we're just gonna go in town with those. I'm so excited. I am so excited. And then we're gonna do some eyeshadow palette, which again, I am extremely excited about that. And here's the palette, you guys. I'm so excited to try this one. These are the perfect eyeshadows for like a very natural, but still kind of glam look. So we're gonna do a nice look with that one too. And um, I also got myself um, a lip foiled from them. It's called a VIP. I was I was really excited to go and do this. I, I, I was watching the website for a while now and I just, I was waiting for some sort, you know, some some new things or some sort of new stuff to put my purchase for. And they had all this, uh, on 4th of July, they had all this big sales going on. So I was like, okay, I gotta get on it and I gotta put my hands on just at least a little bit and try it on and see if it's true. Uh, everything they're saying that the palette, the eye palettes are gorgeous and all that. So. I am excited to try it. I paid, so for the flawless full face, I paid uh, $14.99. And I think regular was like $20, $24 or something like that. The Promise Eyeshadow Quad, I paid $11.99, which is a steal. And then I got uh, the lipstick, I got it for $4.79. And then I got two brushes, uh, each for three thirty-nine. So in total, I only paid forty-seven dollars for all this, 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 and let me just find the two brushes so I can show you guys what I'm talking about. And then these two brushes. So all these. They're just $47. Love it. So let's go and try all these things. I'm gonna, cause I already have my face done. So I'm gonna go in for some contouring. Okay, I'm gonna use this one. This is a very dark one because I got the darker shade. I know it's going to look crazy. Don't worry about it. I know what I'm doing. Um, but I know it's going to look good once I'm blending, blending that in. I like this one better than what they had uh, offering for medium skin tones. So. So I wanted to give it a go. Okay. So I'm gonna get my my little sponge over here.
besides that I mean it's going into my skin really nice it's blending in really nice I really like it. Although this, the color is a little bit too dark, like you just see how that is over here and how I blend it in here. That looks really nice, isn't it? Yep. So now we're gonna blend this one in. What do you guys think about that? I really do enjoy this. I thought it was too dark. I mean, I still think it's a little bit too dark, but that's okay. Once I put, apply everything, it's going to be the right color. But I do like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. It goes into my skin really nice. It doesn't lift any of the foundation or anything like that. I really really enjoy it it looks really nice so let's go in and see what we can do I really like this color I love that's why I bought this palette because of this color this color right here for the highlight I'm like I want to see how is it gonna be how is it gonna look like I am more than excited to try it on so let's see I put too much. Oh, wow. Oh my god, you guys. You see that? Whoa. I just, just, whoa. Check this out. Oh, yes. Whoa. I did put too much though. <laughs> wow. I love that. I love that. I love that a lot. Let's put something on my nose. <laughs> it looks so dark. I look like I am coming from the beach, honey. I got all tanned, okay? I got myself all bronzed up. So now that we have all this, I'm not gonna finish with all my, um, my setting powder because I kind of want to let it sit for a little bit. And while that's happening, I want to play with this. So let's see. This should be really fast and easy. So I'm gonna use this one, this brush. Uh, it's the soft tone brush from them, from Makeup Geek. And just go in the light shade. And this is a really nice soft color. Hey, look at that. I don't know if the camera can just actually catch that, but it looks really, really pretty. Mm -hmm. 
Yep, I like that. I like that a lot. Now, what we're gonna do, let me get a different brush over here. I'm just gonna go in the crease with this one right here. I think that one is called, hmm, it says dark roast or tan lines. I think it's, it's tan lines, yeah. So we're gonna go in with tan lines. That is so pretty. Oh yes, I love that. Okay. And it blends in like it just it just goes really good, really well. And I have wow. That is so cute. Okay. And now I'm going to go a little bit with the darker shade, which is called uh, the Dark Roast. And um, let me see. Let me get a different brush. Or should I use that? I think I'm going to use that. Maybe. Well, no. I kind of still want it going in. So I'm going to go in still with this brush. And just put it on top, just a little bit right there. Okay, I'm gonna have to fix it a little bit, but. I really like it. Um, let me see. What mirror should I use? I want to use theirs. Oh yeah, we're gonna do a blush too. Blush. That blends in like butter, honey. Okay, and now, piece of resistance, this color right here that I just, I cannot wait to try that one on. So let's try this. It is Grandstand. I'm just gonna take it on my finger and just apply it here in the center of my eyelid. And that's what I call a glamorous nude eye look. Check that out. Oh my God, I love this so much. I have to, definitely I have to go and buy more of these because this, it's absolutely gorgeous. Not one single piece of fallout. They blend in like butter. And the colors are just stunning. They're so pigmented. Let me put it on this side as well.
You guys, why didn't I bought this earlier? No, I'm not paid to say this. That and I don't think anyone knows I even exist yet. Because these are um, my very first videos. The very first ones, I mean. This one is going to be my number three or four. So, uh, nope. Nobody knows about it. I paid for it by myself. Let my own money. From my full-time job. That I earned from my full-time job. Ooh, I love that. And now, I want to do, I want to use this, right? Because I want to use this, uh, this brush as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get the dark roast. And try to go for an eyeliner. Guess it does not work. Hmm. Okay, let me see. I'm gonna get from Nightingale Pretty Vulgal Eyeshadow Palette. I am gonna get All Night, which is this one right here. Maybe I need to spray it a little bit. I mean, it does work now, but just, let's see. Yeah, yeah, that's it, honey. Look at that. And now, of course, I have fallouts, but that's because of this one. But, yeah. That, it's really pretty. No. That's that. Okay, now let's see. I apologize for my dog. Now let's see. Um, of course, I have to put my scare and all that. Let me take this. The fallouts. That looks so good, isn't it? Okay, now we're gonna go in with uh, which one? I kind of like this one better, to be honest. I like that one better. So I'm gonna go in with that one and see how it's. Uh, Setting on my face. <gasps> Jeez, look at that pigmentation. I only touch it just a little bit. Oh, this is... mm. Just look at that. That is just perfection. Oh my god.
That is gorgeous. Like just absolutely gorgeous. Okay, let's do next. We're gonna do the eyebrows. I usually use the Nightingale again. And I use the Swoop eyeshadow to do my eyebrows. I know a lot of people are like, why would you use an eyeshadow to, to do your eyebrows? Because this one worked the best for me. So you'll see in a minute what I'm talking about. Just look at that, compared to this. And how long did it take? Not even one minute to do it. So that's why I always use this one. And I use the brush from Aesthetica. I don't even know what number this is. But it's this, the angled one, right there. And I'm done, 30 seconds and I'm done. That's all I need. And it stays put all day long. It does not move, it does not budge, it does not do anything. And I do wear glasses, so I'm happy about that. Because you know when you wear glasses, it's just if it, the eyebrows, I had so many problems with it. You know, by the end of the day, I would have lines, brown lines all over my face. And now I'm gonna go in and set in my face. I'm gonna use, which one should I use for that? Hmm. I'm gonna use my Derma Blend Low Setting Powder. And as a brush, I'm just going to use this big fluffy one from Pure. Alright, and now let's uh, see the lipstick that I got. It's a really pretty color and it's going to work really good with this look. So this is Foiled Lip Gloss VIP. And it's this really beautiful nude that has a little bit of shimmer in it. It feels like it's it's a lip uh lip balm, not a lip gloss. It feels really hydrating. Really love it, you guys. Oh my god, I cannot believe it. I thought there's gonna be some flops in it. There's gonna be at least one that is not I don't like it that much. There is one that I don't like that much. It's this brush. I thought it's gonna be a little bit better um 
but I mean, I don't know. It might be just because I, I still need to figure it out how to work with it. But I mean, my angle brush works like that, that fast. So I don't know. That one is the one that I would say out of all of them that I would say it does not, um, it does, it does not work for me. At least immediately. So I'm going to apply some mascara, which is going to be Light Lashes Camera from Tarte. So we can finish this look. I'm going to put in the description below um, every product that I've used on my face. Okay, so this is the look. I'm gonna make up cake product. Absolutely gorgeous. I would recommend it 100%. So even though this one, they're a little bit darker for my skin, probably I'm gonna use it more. I'm gonna use it a lot this summer because I'm gonna get a little bit darker. You know, when I get tan, I get like this, and this color is going to work amazing when that's going to happen. Um, but even now, I mean, it's not such a big difference than my color. And then, I love this blush. Oh my god, the pigment in it. It's just, it's just, and it goes on like, glides so naturally, so beautiful. Also, this, oh. Gorgeous colors. Oh my god. This is amazing. Uh, this is 10 out of 10 This is so absolutely gorgeous Okay, this is gorgeous. So this is called flawless ever after and this. Just look at those eyes like just look at the colors. This is absolutely gorgeous again um, This eyeshadow for quad Okay <laughs> the Promise Eyeshadow Palette it's called and is I think you can find it at Target because it says Target on it so I it might be able to find a Target which is amazing go ahead and buy it because this is gorgeous and then the lip like just look at that look how gorgeous that is and it's not sticky no problem, very hydrating, very beautiful looking. It doesn't have like those shimmers when you can actually see the glitter. It just, it just shines really nice, you know, very natural, very sexy and glamorous type of thing. So I love, I'm all about that. I love that. Um, I also love this brush as well. It's really gorgeous. I love it. And, um, yeah, let's just uh, throw this hydrating mist on it, on us, and just call it a day. This is pure. Pure Miracle Mist. It's one of my favorite ones. And uh, that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you really liked it. And uh, if you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.